what's happening guys it is thursday 6 36 just pulled out of work and stoked on the week ahead the weekend ahead um if you haven't noticed we've been a little bit inactive on social media in the past two weeks we haven't put out a vlog um, but for the past month kevin and i kind of alternated alternated taking uh two weeks off each from uh mainly producing content uh, for Trad Geeks uh, just because it made sense for us um, with where we're at in life. Um, Kevin and his family are moving into a, a new house um, that is on the same property that he's been managing so it's it's going to be an awesome situation for him. I'm really really pumped for that. Uh, he has been, uh, been working like a dog to get his family moved in and work work and they had their family vacation to the beach. Uh, which was a great time for them. And then for me, well, I'm just gearing up for our busiest time and the second most busiest, I think that works, our uh, second busiest time of the year, back to school time in the music retail industry is a lot of fun. Um, it's all about band instruments and, and uh, school music programs and things like that. So really looking forward to that time in our business. It is hectic and chaotic. So it's, it was nice to just kind of refresh and get back into things over the past uh, the past two weeks, uh, week and a half. Um, but that's why there hasn't been a vlog for two weeks. The first, uh, I think, two weeks that we've missed since coming back from Utah. So it's been uh, been a nice little break, but ready to get back into it. Uh, if anyone's out there hunting on the West Coast, man, best of luck. This is an awesome time to be out hunting. Out there, but there's always future years for us. Um, we're just gearing up for Whitetail. October is going to hit here in PA, and uh, it's going to be on. We've been scouting. Uh, from now until then, vlogs will probably be covering our finalized bow setups as far as trying to get things dialed in, uh, making sure we're hunt ready, ready to go with what we're going to be hunting. Um, stands, scouting always checking trail cameras so um, pretty stoked we got a camp picnic this afternoon so we're gonna spend some time with our family but it's early in the morning so. 20 yards up to the top shooting arrows swallowing bugs last month to archery season. We had our family picnic up at camp. Now I'm home and Juliet's taking a nap. Lisa's doing some studying, so I had about 20 minutes to run out and check some trail cameras. Just gonna check the ones that are close to home. snagged one of my exoduses up from one spot. Alright, well this guy said this trail runs back this way and then it runs out through here. I have a tree stand up right around this corner here. Tucked right back in. You can just see the top of it. Right there. Hopefully, this is a pretty hefty trail right in through here. Hopefully, works out this year. And we follow it out a little bit ways further. And there's a trail right 
trail camera. And there's my other stand. I got a trail camera's moved, so there are positions that's easy to check, quick to check. Um, the two that I have running here close to home at least. So maybe tomorrow I'll get a chance to hike on the other side of the game lands. Um, we'll see what we've got going on for Labor Day. But had a blast of the day spending time with family up at camp. And got to shoot my bow this morning, check trail cameras, and move those cameras. So it's good. I'm just back to the house. Gonna hang out with Lisa and Juliet a little bit more. It's a nice spot. I was walking out the uh, the edge and down below me I heard a couple branches break. So I snuck out to the edge and uh, those two bucks worked through the rubbed up a tree and just slowly kept working down. So both of them are bucks I have trail camera pictures of. Both of them are bucks I've been more than happy with. So really stoked.